I mean, it's Paul Browning from Freedom Hygiene, and I have the pleasure of being here at Ferry Ales Brewery in Fiskerton to show you uh, the UBC cask scan. Uh, traditionally, casks are pre rinsed, washed, uh, rinsed, and then sterilised or disinfected using steam, which can be very effective but very expensive, or paracetic acid, which has also now become quite expensive. The problem with paracetic acid, it's corrosive to the plant, it's corrosive to people, and there's always a danger of leaving traces behind in the cask. Another risk that we have with paracetic acid is that if we don't maintain the parts per million at the optimum dilution, we could actually be spraying or think that we're spraying casks to disinfect them with a weak solution and we're not killing all beer spoilage organisms. Based on the work that we've done at Freedom Hygiene over the last six years in food manufacturing, I'd like to introduce you to UVC cask scan, and it's comprised of two essential pieces of equipment. This is the UVC lamp. In fact, there are two UVC lamps in here, enclosed in a shatterproof Teflon sleeve, and this is inserted, of course, into the cask, and it fits very snugly there. Looking at this side of the equipment, we have a control box, we have an on-off button, and when we switch this on, we see that we have a countdown timer, it's timed at 60 seconds, and then moving across, we have the start button. When I press that, the green lamp comes on, and the countdown timer is going down to count down from 60 seconds, which is the uh, disinfection time that we've chosen, and that will go down to zero. At the end of the 60 seconds, the green light will go off to tell us that we've finished the disinfection phase, and we can then disinfect the next cast. Twenty-three seconds, and it's counting down. So the UVC works by destroying the DNA of microorganisms that can cause beer spoilage in a matter of seconds. So now we see that. The lamp here has gone off, telling us that the phase has been completed and the timer has gone back to 60 seconds. So we can now take the UVC lamp out of the cask. That is now ready for filling and we can disinfect the next cask. One of the safety features of this piece of kit is that there is an inductive proximity switch here which means that if I switch the machine on, the lamp doesn't come on. Now that's for safety reasons, because it's not a good idea for us to be looking at UVC lamps, because the UVC light uh, can cause problems if we look at it for too long. Just like looking at the sunshine on a hot day, it's not a good idea to stare at it. The same with UVC. So the safety feature is that unless the proximity switch here can detect that it's inside the cask, the machine will not be allowed to switch on. So that's the UVC cask scan. Um, if any breweries out there are interested in trialling this free of charge, please give me a call on 0774 89 8904 or paul at freedomhygiene.co.uk. Thank you.